The border once again getting top billing in the battleground state of Arizona. Former President Donald Trump pitching a plan to hire 10,000 more border agents and to give raises to those already serving. After I win, I will be asking Congress immediately to approve a 10% raise. The National Border Patrol Council lending their support right back. We strongly support and endorse Donald J. Trump. Donald Trump also laying out a plan to go after migrant criminals using a law from 1798 called the Alien Enemies Act, a wartime authority that allows for subjects of a hostile nation to be apprehended, restrained, secured, and removed. Trump also wanting to implement an automatic 10-year jail sentence for those who return to the country after being removed, and the death penalty for any migrant who kills an American citizen or law enforcement officer. Migrant criminals have been making news with a focus on the Venezuelan street gang Train de Aragua, including at this Aurora, Colorado apartment complex. The incidents were limited to a handful of apartment conflicts, uh, apartment complexes. Only, Martha, do you hear yourself? Only a handful of apartment complexes in America were taken over by Venezuelan gangs. It's tough talk. The Trump campaign is betting will pay off with polls consistently showing his border policies are far more popular than those of the Biden-Harris administration. It's one reason Harris has moved to the center on immigration policy. I have taken on crim transnational criminal organizations that traffic in guns, drugs, and human beings, and I've prosecuted them. The Harris campaign slamming Trump for suggesting he'd hire new border agents despite convincing Republicans to tank a legislative plan that did just that. Trump blocked the only thing we had for his own political gain. Differences on full display in the final weeks of the campaign. I'm Christine Frizzau reporting.